Hello everyone, in this video I will show you a solution that you can use this 4G module SIM7600 module in Home Assistant by ESP Home so that you can send your notification by short message or by voice call because sometimes if you use mobile phone application for notification will have some delay time so if you want uh, send it uh, faster and immediately so you can use short message or by voice call sometimes for emergency state uh, this will be very useful so in this video i will use this uh, sim 7600 module with king kong a8s board actually you can use any king kong esp32 board just have the 4g module interface or 2g module interface so we'll use for this video okay let's look at the hardware firstly and you can see here is our king kong a8s board uh, because it can install this 4G module you can see I have used this 4G module for testing uh, this is SIM7600G and also you can use SIM7600E uh, just this used for American and uh, E version used for your report uh, all can use by the same uh, protocol no problem just use the standard AT command so in this board I have insert uh, this 4G module and I have connect with this uh, antenna, GSM antenna at here and this mobile phone I will test with this uh, receive the short message and voice call okay let's back to my computer uh, you can see I have used this Kinkone A8S board uh, because you can see there are 4G module socket and 2G module socket so it's easy for me for testing and uh, write the code and there are some different binary sensor you can see have a um, button so I can press this button to test the sensor and actually you can connect with this D1 to D6 uh, D8 to binary sensor for for example dark sensor motion sensor and a smoky sensor water level sensor no problem because I can uh, use this sim card install this module and install it here uh, this is 2G module sim 800 but I have using testing for 4G module SIM7600 okay you can see this our uh, web page web service of A8S board I have already downloaded by ESP Home and you can see here is our ESP Home uh, that I have created A8S board you can see this is online so you can see I can click edit and it's also very easy if you want uh, make a call you can see uh, this is light 1, light 2, light 3 until light 8 that I have created for relay output and this YAML file you can download from our form you can see how to use, uh, make voice call by 4G module at here and this is testing photo and this is logo output for web servers and you can see that is the ESP home YAML file you can check at here or you can download it at here uh, no problem so uh, at here you can see we can create a binary sensor before but we just add this command uh, just one two three four five five lines command so that we can make a voice call it's very easy but uh, before you add this five command uh, you need to define your UART uh, for for this this command because I have used the A8S board so the TXT and IXT pin is GPIO 13 and GPIO 15 uh, if you use another Kinkoni board you can change the corresponding uh, TXT and IXT pins uh, according to your board schematic uh, so you can see uh, this is three lines uh, you need to set and the debug information you can disable or enable it oh yeah no problem uh, just i want to see the whether the information is sent or received so you can see if you want call your phone number you just replace my phone number to your phone number so it's very easy so this call uh, this named call button is input 1 when I press this input 1 or the input 1 for binary sensor is a triangle so that will have a voice call to my number so you can replace this uh, for your number and, and at last you can see uh, this uh, binary sensor 1 just this call number okay I will test it how it works 
And as you can see, this is the digital important one. So you can see, I press this button, and this is on. You can see, uh, this become on. You can see, uh, this can only control. This I have renamed uh, this SIM card as uh, this number. And this time you can see, uh, this is called my mobile phone. So you can see, uh, this is voice call incoming. And we can also see this, you can see, uh, this output, the information to 4G module, and uh, show that here. So the call button, uh, one is on and one is off, uh, what will be uh, send this command, okay? And the next, we will look at how to send a short message by SIM7600. And you can see, in the back, and here you can see, send short message, and that will be very useful for voice call. And also we can define as uh, the number two, digital import two, to send a short message. You can see in our uh, Home Assistant uh, config YAML, you can see this is digital import two. I rename it send SMS button. And here you can see the arm press, I have added this code, just added this code. And the first, uh, you need to write the UART uh, for this AT command. That is set the sh short message to test module for uh, SIM 7600. Uh, just change our work mode to test mode. Uh, and the second, you need to tell the ESP home which number, mobile phone number, you will send. Uh, so this is my mobile phone number. And also you can change to your mobile phone number. So where to send the message. And then last, just tell the ESP home what information send to the people's mobile phone by SMS. So you can see, I just send the King only SMS sensor. Uh, so this is, can't be changed because you can see this is a terminal uh, for this this one, country plus Z. So that use uh, hex code in this one. So you don't need to change this one. So if you want to uh, change this message uh, for any information, for, for example, A, B, C, D, E, F, you just change to this one. And this one will be reversed and uh, can't be changed. Okay? So you can see uh, this is our test information for SMS sensor. Uh, maybe you can uh, modify the uh, content. You can send uh, someone is incoming, uh, the sensor is triangle. You can be careful. Okay? This is for the binary sensor tool. So also you can see our web page, and you will see as uh, this send message button. Now I will press this import tool. Just import tool. Just press this button. This second you can see. I press this button, and you can see uh, this is for on state. And now you can see uh, I have received a message, and you can see it's here. And, can, and import, you can see the King Kony SMS sensor. So this time I have received the message. So this digital import one for voice call and the digital import two for send short message. So you can make automation in Home Assistant. Uh, for example, let sound sensor and try go for voice call uh, if the sensor is very important. And the sound sensor, uh, check with the short message. Uh, when this, uh, what level is check, or when the sound sensor is check, will send short message to your mobile phone by this 4G module. Okay, I think this can use the notification function for your mobile phone in your IoT project. It's very useful. Okay, thanks for watching.